Hey everybody and welcome back to Doom 3. I watched the video back and could not help but notice that the letters are completely illegible from your point of view. Uh... Sorry. There really isn't much I can do. I'm planning on getting a new com new laptop very soon, but... And then I'll get the capture card, and then you'll be able to read these these things. But until then, I'm the Blues32, and we're in medical storage. And I open this thing. Just as I promised I would. Now then. Sir, I think you should lay back down. You're not looking so good. Ow! Damn it! Sir. Oh, you wankers! Ah, bunch of bastards. That could have gone better. Shouldn't have mess been messing around. Doctor? Doc? You okay? You're not looking so good, Doc. The doctor's out. Uh, okay. Now, what was I doing, anyway? I think I was heading back to a uh, Marine HQ. <sighs> now I'm shooting myself up with a drink. Down, boy. Someone lost their helmet. And their face. If anybody sees this man's face, please call. Uh. Huh, I didn't actually think that would work. Tyson. Let's read his emails first. Staff Sergeant Tyson. I have been a major supporter of putting sentry bots on routine patrols. In the past, they have proven very reliable. That changed today. I witnessed two of our guys doing maintenance on a bot in Mars City. While having it only partially assembled, they activated its sensors to test their repairs. All of a sudden, the sentry locked on to one of the Marines as an enemy and began firing at him. If the, an if the ammo had been loaded, that Marine would have been dead. Thankfully, the other Marine was able to immobilize it quickly. The sentry bot is powerful, but maybe too powerful. Why don't we need that much firepower in Mars City? Except for the odd report of individuals going a little crazy, we don't have many problems. Do we really expect the sentry bots to know the difference between someone having a bad day and someone gone mad? I hope you, you can talk to Sarge about this before something worse happens. Sergeant Tyson, we have a new troop inbound to replace Allen. He'll be arriving on the next transport. Be sure to get the manifest filled out for his first issue, Sergeant Kelly. Sergeant Tyson, due to the upcoming personnel transfer, we will be changing the weapon storage code in the Marine Command to 584. The change will excuse me, take effect on November 15th, 2145. 
Thank you, Central Security. Audio report on troop morale. Morale here is beginning to drop. It's nothing to worry about yet since I keep my Marines sharp and ready to go. But events at the base are wearing on the troops. There have been a lot of things happening here on the base. I believe the UAC experiments being performed here must be the cause. Out here, yeah. they could be experimenting on God knows what. There are quite a few people missing. And no Marines, of course. It's the civilian population I am referring to. Bottom line, whatever it is they have going on here has my men on a razor's edge. At this point, there is no cause for alarm, but I am requesting we rotate squads every 90 days instead of every 180. Okay. I will continue to report as the situation develops. Squad it's good we have the new Marines en route. Fresh faces will help. Sergeant Tyson, out. Yeah, everybody's losing theirs. What else you got? Audio troop report deployments. confirming new troop deployments for the Mars City Marine Facility, October 30th, 2145. The new troops will be arriving within a few days. I've started a series of training exercises focusing on close quarters small weapons combat, as well as instituting mandatory refresher courses on all munitions and weapons in our armory. In response to the large number of security breaches and general feelings of ill will around the base, I've doubled security details, placing two Marines at each checkpoint. This additional presence should help calm things down. I expect that the incoming Marines are not quite as green as the last deployment. They've turned out okay, but some combat experience will go a long way right now. Sergeant Tyson, out. Isn't that what I just put in? Five... Come on, eight. Damn it. Damn it! It's really hard to do this. Why did it, was this so easy before? There we go. Ah, what do we got? What do we got? Okay, apparently that'll do me. Okay. Now that we've read all that guy's emails and... Established. Marine, I can't Hi. believe you're still alive. I'm What's unable to return to, to Mars City. All passages out of the Delta complex have been blocked. I'm setting up a command post here. I can monitor status reports of the entire base from Delta Central Authority and communicate with other Marine teams. It's your mission to link up with Bravo team and get that transmission sent. Head Why? toward Alpha Labs. It's the fastest way to find them. I'll update your PDA security clearance from here. Good so job. You want me and good luck, Marine. You want me to go to Alpha Labs to meet up with Bravo? Okay. Alpha to Bravo. Or Alpha for Bravo. Why not? Okay. I don't know getting through there. I'm afraid you'll have to come around this corner, sir. And when you do, you'll be missing your head. Or not. Maybe you'll make me eat my words. In front of... I don't know. You people. Oh, you bet. I've had enough. Why am I so terrible all of a sudden? I've played this before. Let me see something. Controls. Uh, I don't know what that means. What does Southpaw mean? Alright, hopefully that runs a little bit. That, that not runs, but operates a little better. It probably won't. I probably should have made it less, not more. I am so used to 
some other game that requires me to push R2 and L2 for something. I have been playing uh, Dying Light on PlayStation 4 a bit. It's messing me up. Like, I keep pushing the up button in order to, uh, turn on my flashlight. It's L1. Oh, you bastard! I could roll. Perhaps even shake and rattle. I used to have a flashlight. And I got a cool thing on my armor. I guess he's jealous. Marine, did you run across no. any operational sentry bots? You no. Know. Those guys pack a lot of firepower. No! I'm in mourning. <laughs> Why? There were so many turkeys left unpunched. The UAC is here to help you. Psychological services are free and confidential. I don't need any psychological services. I'm perfectly fine. Ow! Perfectly fine. Someone needs to needs to lay off the uh arm. It's not healthy. I was trying to come up with a joke there, but I kind of blanked. Like, wait. Do I, if I say a food, will somebody get offended? buddy. That, oh, thanks for waiting. He waited for me. Marine, you gotta get to Bravo team quickly. They need all the firepower they can get. Sending that transmission is critical to our survival. Oh, it's not that. Somebody shooting me? Hear something else, boy? What is it? What's there? I think we got them all, little buddy. Yes, you can go to sleep now. It's okay. We 
took care of all the nasty demons and monstrosities. Excuse me. Robocola! Thirst Burst. No, Thirsty Burst. I like Thirst Burst better. It's catchy. I'm ready. I wasn't ready. Exit to Mars City. Or exit Mars City. Now leaving Mars City. Administration facilities, the corporate presence on Mars. Unitary space executives located in the upper levels are responsible for all local and interplanetary administrative tasks. The facility also houses data archives and a global network access station. Whew. Tried to dodge revenant rockets by quickly running behind cover. Can I, can I go back? Try banking grenades around corners to kill enemies waiting in ambush. Just trying to read all of this for you, since, you know, you can't make it out. Give me some piece of shit. I'm a little hesitant. I don't think you understand, Dr. Petruger. No, I understand everything. I'm telling you now, Doctor, the UAC is taking over this operation. Operation? What? Is that what you're calling it? The situation is out of control. It's not out of control, Swan. You are. I'll you're out of order. And you this whole court's out of order. In control of nothing. Do you understand? Yes, Petruga. I think I do understand. What you got okay. there? Okay. Plan B. Oh, what's in the box? Always pushing the wrong buttons. Welcome to the Alpha Labs. Formally Thanks. designated Phase One by the Union Aerospace Offworld. <laughs> the Alpha Labs began construction hey, 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 hey. on October 29th, 2095, and became fully operational on October 2130. Now you're dead. Originally created as the Prime Science and Research Facility. Alpha Labs are responsible. Yada yada yada. If I want to watch that that video, I can get a, find it on video disc somewhere later. Just me. Just me again. Now. Why aren't you dead? Yeah, I know it's shotgun supposed to be for close range, but still, it dead by now. Ah, here it is. Huh? What? <laughs> Sir. I am tired of these people. Beginning to think I should be tra I should get a transfer. Armaments in the cabinet. Allen. Per our earlier conversation, I've stocked the storage cabinet in your area with some ammunition and oh, me. security armor. The door code is 586. I don't know what's going on around here, but we can't be too careful. I hope to God we never need to use this stuff. If I hear anything else, I'll email you. Ethan. Alan, I heard that UAC Corporate is sending someone up here to check on Petruger. His name is Elliot Swan. I don't know who he is, but John said he's a real ball buster. Said that he always travels with a bodyguard. This can't be a good situation. I hope this swan doesn't shut us down. We are so close to solving the stability problems and the transfer errors are exceptionally low now. 
I'll keep you posted if anything goes down. Mr. Donger, online pharmacy. No doctor visit needed. We believe that ordering medication should be as simple as ordering anything else on the net. We can ship drugs anywhere in the galaxy. Embargoes, banned pharmaceuticals, no problem. Go to www.martianbuddy.com for, de for my details. I believe that used to be a thing. I'm pretty sure that, e that uh, website no longer exists. Hey, grenade. Director William Banks. La di da. Okay. Yay! <laughs> Gotcha. I really shouldn't be, you know, so triumphant over shooting an imp. It's just an imp. What are you do? Are you throwing things? Got an explosive barrel, sir. You could hurt somebody doing that. Don't stop, buddy. There's nothing you can do for me. They're yeah, all your gone. eyes are gone. <coughs> Surprised us. They just came out of nowhere. Seriously, where are your eyes? Your teeth seem kind of jagged. There's still a few squads operating. But they're all cut off from each other. Try to find them. You sound like that guy in the vent. <coughs> and you lived about as long as he did, too. Rest in pieces, soldier. Is it soldier or do I call him a, just call him Marine? I mean, he is a Marine. But I, does soldier apply? I, I don't know. I don't know. Access Gee. denied. Locate the PDA for William Banks. How do I get up there? Day in Doom, backpacks doubled your ammo capacity. Is that all I came in here for? All right then. Hang on, it's a little bit difficult to do because you gotta push R three down. And then no, you gotta jump, push R three in the air. Okay, there we go. There we go. Missing something? Oh, clearly. Even if I 
could get up on that box, it wouldn't get me up there. Hmm, perhaps if I double back. Yeah, that's a pretty good indication that I'm doing the right thing. Yeah, hey, you! You're dead now. Who was you just a. God damn it. Son of a bitch. You broke the door! Now we had to get somebody from maintenance to fix this, if he's not a zombie. <sighs> Making people's lives harder, that's what you demons are for, isn't it? Hi. Son of a bitch, sir. Oh, you bastard! Actually coming in from behind. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, shoot up. Oh. What are we at here? Call ended. This is that guy's briefcase, so I guess this is where they would. Oh, uh, we're at. Uh, Sir, I was talking. Let's see what it says on this thing. Can't make it out. UAC. BFG 9000. Well, well. bit overkill considering the, the situation, what, what you thought the situation was. Thought there was a doctor who wouldn't listen to you. So you brought a BFG? What were you expecting? You? Lord Vader? I thought you were dead, Lord Vader. Probably shouldn't have done that. And what do we have here? Security override. What was that? Hi! Cyber dog. Or maybe a cyber bear. Can't come in. Oh God! Frick! Really should not have let myself get cornered that easy. Okay, that was a good shot. That was a shot worth ending the video on. So thank you guys so much for watching. I am the Blues32. This has been Doom 3. TTFN. Ta-ta for now.